Hi guys! Today I'll show you how to make roasted broccoli with garlic butter. Heat your oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit or 220 degrees Celsius. I've washed my broccoli heads. They're a little over 2 pounds total, 900 grams. Cut the florets off and then lengthwise into bite-sized pieces. Put them in a big bowl. Don't throw out the stem. I'll show you what to do with them in another video. To the florets, add 3 tablespoons of olive oil, 3 quarters of a teaspoon salt, and 1 teaspoon ground black pepper. It's easiest to mix everything up with your hands. All of the broccoli is nicely coated in olive oil. Put the broccoli on a baking sheet. You don't have to grease it because there is enough olive oil on the broccoli. Spread them out so each piece is touching the tray. Make sure to put them flat side down. Roast them in the heated oven for about 20 minutes. I put the tray on the second top rack in my oven, a few inches away from the oven ceiling. This is how it looks after 23 minutes. Ovens vary, so check after 18 to 20 minutes sooner if your oven runs very hot. See the golden brown spots all over. Of course, you can eat them just like this. However, I like to add garlic butter, which takes this simple broccoli to another level. Heat up two tablespoons of salted butter, grate two large garlic cloves, You should get about one tablespoon of grated garlic. Add the garlic to the melted butter and stir. Cook about a minute on low heat until the raw flavor of the garlic goes away. They don't need to be golden brown, just soft. Add one teaspoon of apple cider vinegar and stir. You can use regular vinegar if you don't have apple cider. The vinegar cuts the richness of the butter. Pour the sauce all over the broccoli. Mix it really well right on the tray. The broccoli has a light, crispy texture on the outside. It's still a little crunchy, not mushy at all. The garlic is not overpowering, just the right amount, and the tiny bit of vinegar gives it a slight tang. It is pretty enough to serve with a holiday meal. Kids and adults who don't like broccoli will eat it if it's golden brown like this. You definitely have to try it out and let me know what you think. Subscribe and turn on notifications for the next video. I'll see you soon with another easy and tasty recipe. Thanks for watching.